Thank you, Governor. We're all painfully aware of the very real impact our recession is having. Unemployment's not an economic statistic, it's real people who are struggling, who are hurting, who are having tremendous difficulty. And I think all of us in every elected office realize we need to do everything possible to help our working families that are struggling, to help California small businesses that are the ones that are going to create jobs. And it's imperative that we come together to actually get something done. Over the last week, a group of us has been meeting regularly to try and come to an agreement on the governor's jobs plan. And today I'm pleased to join the governor, my colleagues from both sides of the aisle, business and labor, to announce an agreement that will provide a billion dollars a year in real and permanent tax relief to California small businesses and working families. By switching to a mandatory single sales factor, we're closing an indefensible loophole. By closing a corporate loophole that only benefits out-of-state corporations, we're providing real and permanent tax relief to Californians. The measure is much needed and will do a lot to help get people working again. Under the current system, companies that employ workers in California are at a competitive disadvantage. The opportunity to elect which system benefits you most provides a illogical incentive for companies to remain outside of California by choosing the election or the tax code that benefits them most. This change is the right thing to do. It's in place in 25 other states, including Republican states like Texas, where Governor Rick Perry signed into law. New Jersey, where Governor Chris Christie signed it into law. Or Governor Mitch Daniels, who recently signed it into law, along with a number of Democrat governors. Because it's the right policy, it makes sense, and it's time to do it. Today we have a chance to help get California back on track to provide real relief to our working families and small businesses, and I'm honored to join all of those here today to announce this agreement. Thank you. Well, I think there's a difference in, in tax reform, and what we're talking about here is tax reform that's revenue neutral. Uh, it'll encourage job growth and reward companies that are here, and then provide a real incentive and, and real permanent tax relief uh, to Californians. And so if the net-net effect is revenue neutral, uh, then, then in my eyes that's tax reform. If it encourages job creation here and rewards Californians, then that's a, that's a really good thing. And I hope a lot more of our colleagues will join uh, Assemblyman Smythe and myself in doing this. Thank you.